Hey all, it's Johnny Mullet. Today we're going to do another Casio watch video. Today we're going to talk about a watch that is one of the coolest watches I ever had. I used to envy the kids back in the 80s who had them. And since I'm an adult and I can do what I want, I got one myself. Um, so this particular watch, we're going to add up all the pros and subtract the cons and then multiply that up and see what we got so this watch is pretty undivisible and we're gonna calculate how awesome it is so if you haven't caught on yet we are talking about the Casio calculator watch this is the model CA 53W it's a very very popular watch um, a lot of uh, TV and movie stars have been seen wearing a uh, watch just like this or similar to it and it's pretty slick. I really love this watch and actually I love it so much I have two Casio CA53W watches because I wear one for work because it's so convenient to have a simple calculator right on your wrist where I can do calculations while I'm on the job. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna check it out and talk about it and show you the features and see what it's all about so let's turn this camera around and show you what we got okay so here we are um, let's just take a look at the actual watch itself as you see it's very thin and very lightweight this thing this is the uh, manual that you get for the module this thing is very light very thin very comfortable I really really enjoy this watch um, the band on this watch is not the greatest. Um, if you read some of the reviews on Amazon, they say that the band probably is going to break in a year or so because it likes to dry rot. But this thing is very flexible and very comfortable. and It's, it's really nice to wear. It's a nice wearable watch. And for a wrist shot, you can see it actually fits you know decent I don't have huge wrists but I don't have little tiny ones either and it actually fits the wrist very very nice and as I said it's thin it don't catch your your shirt sleeve it's really really cool so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you the features while it's on wrist because most people when they do a, a review on this watch they're doing it like this but I'm gonna use this calculator watch exactly um, how I wear it and show you how I use it uh, real quick uh, just wanted to show you you got your calculator keys and your um, add subtract divide multiply equals and on the side here we have a mode button this takes you through your different modes and then this recessed button here is for changing settings so let's actually go into here and check it out so during your regular time mode what we have is um, your basic screen and it shows you you have AM and PM indicator here you have an alarm indicator and an hourly chime indicator you get the hours the minutes the seconds and the day of the week if you want to know the the entire date unfortunately this watch doesn't show the the actual date on the face of the watch in the normal screen but with a simple press of the division button you get the date right there displayed on your watch. Um, one of the negatives is there is no backlight for this watch. So if you're going to do some mad calculations in the middle of the night, it's not going to happen. But all in all, the light is really the only downfall in my opinion. So what we're going to do here is I'm going to move stuff out of the way so we don't lose our focus. And we are going to go through the features of this watch. Uh, the first mode we have here is calculator mode and if you want to silence the beeps as you hear every time I press a button you hear that beep we can silence that in calculator mode by pressing the recess button so what is a calculator good for well this simple calculator is great for doing simple multiplication division adding subtracting and it's what I do it is a eight digit calculator so you can type in eight digits with no problem a lot of people complain that the buttons are too small and 
so forth. But as you see, I have no issue and I have big crippled ass fingers and I have no problem pressing the buttons. Every now and then I may make a mistake, but it happens. It's not a big deal. Um, you can clear just by pressing that button again. So, for instance, I use this at work a lot because, you know, I do a, you know, a $30 inspection, all right, and then we're going to add a uh, $32.58 and uh, 58 cent emission test, and we get a total of sixty-two fifty-eight, and then I want to put tax on that, it just times by .06. And equals, and there is my tax rate at $3.75. So simple, simple math, and it's really convenient to have right on your wrist. Now you can clear by pressing zero or by pressing the mode button. So, I mean, you know, eight digit calculator, what more can you ask for? Plus, you know, it's really cool that you can do stuff, you know, like when you were kids and you got bored and you wanted to spell something out you could always do the uh do the hell boob um one of my favorites i like to do is uh i like to put hello on my watch by 0.7734 and there you go now while you're in this mode it'll stay like this for some time um maybe a, a few minutes and then it'll go back to time mode and whatever you type in there will disappear but suppose you're somewhere and you meet somebody and you get their number and you want to store it. You get their phone number. You have it on your watch. It'll stay on there for a few minutes to give you a chance to write the number down or add it to your cell phone. But like I said, there is no date, actual data bank. It does not store anything. So basically, it is what it is. But for simple calculations, it's awesome. All right, let's go into the next mode. The next mode we have here will be the alarm mode. Um, whenever you're done with whatever mode you're playing with, it'll take you right back to your normal time mode. So calculator and alarm. Now um, you can turn, or I'm sorry, use the recess button to change your alarm time, AM or PM. Um, we also can turn the alarm on and off. You can see that little thing pop up there the alarm is now on the alarm is now off you can also turn on and turn off the hourly signal if you see right here signal on signal off I think it's one of these buttons here sorry uh, you know having these old eyes really doesn't help there it is now the hourly chime is off and then the hourly chime needs to come back on there we go so there's my hourly chime and alarm function. So when I'm done playing, it's going to go back to normal time mode. So we go through calculator, alarm, dual time. Now I have friends that live on the west coast in California, and it's nice to know what time it is out there if I want to make a phone call and don't want to call them too early in the morning. So I have my dual time mode set for the west coast. This three hours behind. And you can use the recess button here to go ahead and change those uh, times, whatever time you want in your dual time. And then the last mode we have is stopwatch mode. Every watch got to have a stopwatch, right? So you can start your, your stopwatch and then you stop your start watch. It also has a lap feature where you can start your timer and then you can do a quick lap time at around 10 seconds here. Lap time is displayed. You can record your lap time. And then you go back into the normal um, stopwatch and it's still running. So you can stop it and you can clear it by pressing zero. So it's just a simple stopwatch mode. Easy peasy. And then we go back to normal time mode. So this is a really cool watch. Like I said, it, it fits so nice. It's very comfortable. I get lots of compliments on it. I really, really like this watch. So since I am wearing one as a work watch and you have seen what has happened to uh, my F91W um, working as a diesel mechanic it goes through some abuse but one thing I did notice about this watch it's it doesn't scratch as easy as you can see the keyboard is a little bit taller than the the display so 
it does protect it from scratches to a point, a little bit. Um, that's why I purchased a new one so I could have a nice one. This is the one I'll wear on the weekends and so forth. And I like to keep it nice and clean. And this is the watch that I am wearing while working. So as you can see, this one here is a little dirty and so forth, but it's not beat up. So it's actually been a really, really good watch. I actually love it. It's very comfortable and nice to wear. Awesome little calculator watch. That's probably why it's so popular. So really the only con with the calculator watch is there's no backlight. And I can live without that. I, I can actually live without that. Anyone who has owned a Casio F91W, they have a backlight, but you're basically living without one because it's that bad. Um, real quick, I just wanted to show you, this is the classic F91W. It's a very comfortable, nice watch. It's a little small for my wrist. It kind of looks like a child's watch. That's why I don't wear it as much as I used to. Sometimes I'll wear it, you know, at work. It's been my work watch for several months. It's been really, really good. What an awesome little watch. But for comparison, I just wanted to show you the size. So you've got the F91W and the calculator watch. As you can see, the calculator watch is a little bit bigger, you know, it's, but it's not huge. It's not a very large watch. And then you compare the thickness and let's get these babies uh, set up so you can see it real quick. As you can see, the calculator watch is not thick at all. It's not uncomfortable. That's what makes it so nice. It's a very comfortable wearing watch. It gets lots of attention when you're wearing it. Um, people like to come over and you know ask about it. Oh, is that a calculator watch? Oh, that's pretty cool. Or yeah, the ladies like to push the buttons and stuff. So that's what makes it unique. It's just it's so retro. It just takes me back to the 80s when my hair was in style, Camaros, hot tall hair ladies you know what I'm talking about the 80s one of the best decades ever I wish we can go back but unfortunately we can't but we can reminisce with a Casio watch so thank you all for watching I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you next time